I'm going to go around and, and point out a few t-shirts and shorts, ask how much they are with no intention of buying them yet. Because I want to work out how, what the going rate is. I want to make sure that I've only got small change on me. It's awkward when you haggle really hard and then you know, you're paying for something that's maybe $3 and you have to give a note that's worth $10 and that can be really awkward. Oh, we've got some boxes here. I need some boxes. Sabadi, uh, I need Tao Dai. Tao Dai? Jet Sip Ha Pan. Oh, wow. Oh, no, no. no. Jet Sip Ha Pan. Tony, Sao Ha Pan. Sao Ha Pan. Oh. No, same, same. Okay. Ni, okay. Ni, uh, noi. Bo, nyai, nyai. Yai con lao, bo yai con phalang. Abo. Hamad. Pang. Hamad. Sao pan. Sao pan. Oh, sao pan. I, many, many lie. Me lie. No, no, bo, bo, bo. Maybe later, Chuck Noi, Chuck Noi. Chuck Noi, maybe later, okay, I'll come back. Okay, Sao Pan, okay. <laughs> Chuck Noi. Okay, well, let me just see. Okay. I'll buy one. Ao Nung. Nung. Yeah. I'm kind of happy paying $2 for a pair of boxes, to be honest with you. Yeah. Doi. So, the ethical rule of haggling is to make sure that both parties are happy. If you're happy paying the price, don't just try and batter the person down to try and get it as, as low as possible, because that's not right. Okay. I may have finally found some big bloody boxes. This has been so hard in Laos to find some actually proper fitting boxes. So I've bought one pair. If they fit, then I'm gonna come back and buy about 10 pairs, to be honest with you. It's been so hard to find boxes. Let's try and find some shorts. We're on a roll, this is good. This is, this is a good omen. If they give me a price that's way, way over, I, it's, too, it's too high to start with, then I'm not even gonna, gonna try. I know that there'll be someone else that will give me a much lower price to start with. It'll be a much easier, quicker process with the haggle. <laughs> There's actually some there's some t-shirts here. I swear this Lao lady is laughing at me and I'm about to buy something off of her as well. Sabadi. Tao Dai, Ani? Sen Sip Pan. So that's 100,000, so that's $10. <laughs> that lady's cracking up at me. <laughs> Absolutely cracking up at me. Maybe it's because my boxes fell out of my, my bag and I'm just, I'm just walking around the market holding a pair of boxes, talking to myself as a phalang in a foreign country. We've just got to put these boxes away because everyone's staring at them. They might think they're like used or something. I've just bought them, they're fresh. You don't really show your underwear in, in Southeast Asia. It's a cultural faux pas. Don't hang them high when you hang them out to dry. Ah, oh, that rhymed. Yeah, you don't hang them high because your, your head is sacred and underwear is dirty, so you keep them low, out of sight. Sabadi, uh, koi Thai video, dai bo? These are quite heavy. But they might be right, actually. I don't want anything with elephants on it because everyone, every traveller wears elephants. Um, hmm, maybe, uh, me, yai, and, hmm, tao dai, ha sip ha, ha sip ha, okay, so 55,000, so that is more expensive than I thought they would be, oh, hmm, they're quite nice though, I like, I'm a sucker for patterns, currently got some patterns on me now. Uh, I think they're just, they're not, 
they're not perfect and I'm not prepared to pay five and a half dollars for a pair of shorts if they're not perfect but Tao Dai Noi Tao uh, Dai Noi Sa Sam Sip uh, I don't think there's any haggling on this one Kup Chai Kup Chai <laughs> so it looks like the going rate is about five dollars for a decent pair of shorts not just like your crappy pair Sabadi, Tony Tao Dai, Si Sip Pan, Sao Pan Gadai, Sam Sip, Sam Sip, Sam Sip Gadai, Sam Sip Ha, it does have a sign saying Sam Sip Ha. Okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know, I don't know. I, maybe come back. Good price, but I think maybe I can get cheaper. Sao Ha, Sao Ha Pan. Last price, good price, Sam Sip. Oh, I can't. Kop Chai, Kop Chai, Kop Chai. Yeah, so he was a good sport. That's the kind of guy you want to find when you want to haggle. And I'll come back to him if I can't find anything. It's real like social anxiety control and exercise when, when I come out and do this, when I'm just the only, only phalang walking around with the camera. There's some here. I like my patterns. Yeah, these are all right. Sabadi. Uh, I need Tao Dai. Ha Sip. Yeah, again, everywhere Ha Sip. I think I'll go back to the uh, the, the other the, the other place. Uh, Tao Dai, Ani. Uh, ha Sip. Okay, so, I mean, you can feel the energy of that dude. He He doesn't really want to interact with me, so. There's no point in trying to haggle with him. You gotta pick your haggler as well. I tell you what, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to the, the place that Sam Sip had and uh, go by them because the going rate for the, the shorts round here is definitely $5. I'm gonna cut it all out, but I've asked about 15 places with shorts. All the same shorts as well. I don't know if you've noticed that. They must get them all from the same place. I've asked loads of places. It's $5 for the going rate. There's a dude that's doing them for a lot cheaper at 35,000, so I'm gonna go take that one. Oh, sick. I've literally just found a much cheaper pair of shorts. I was going about to buy a pair of shorts for 35,000 and these are 25,000. Hopefully they'll fit. I'm just going to go for it anyway. Uh, Sabadi. I don't know who's... Oh, uh, Al Ani. Sorry. I didn't know who was, who was working here. Well, that's a result. Just found a much cheaper pair of shorts. $2.50. Some fake Adidas shorts. Much happier with that. I guess I'll end my, end my video on that. It's actually a success. I've got some big, a big pair of boxers, which I haven't been able to do in about at least 12 months of travel. And got a decent pair of shorts as well. Awesome. Anyway, see you later, guys. This has been the, uh, this has been the night market in VNTN.